Hello. In this video we are going to do a quick overview of some of the main sections and features found in Quicken, such as the accounts and transactions, reports, budgets, and mobile and web. After setting up Quicken and adding your accounts, you will see a screen similar to this. This is your register and your accounts list. You can view your accounts on the left account list panel. Accounts are divided up into banking, such as checking, savings, or credit cards, rental property, business, investing, and property and liability accounts, such as loans. Once you have selected an account, you will see your transactions displayed in the register. Quicken offers numerous reporting options to help get a better snapshot of your current financial situation. These can be accessed from the Reports drop-down. Here you can find various report types and subtypes, such as banking, investing, and business reports. You can access graphs from this menu as well, and you can also access your credit score report. You can also go to the Reports and Graph Center for a more detailed view of your report options. Quicken also offers planning tools to help you budget your money. These budgeting tools can be accessed from the Planning tab on the home screen. In the Planning main page, you can view the current standing of your budgeted categories. If you want to create a new budget, you can do this by clicking the Budget Actions tab and going down to Create New Budget. You can also change the way you view information on the planning page with the options at the top. You can select different intervals of time, such as monthly, quarterly, yearly, quarter to date, or year to date. You can also change from the graph view to the annual view. Do you need to access your information on the go? Now you can view your Quicken data on your mobile device through the companion app or any web-connected computer via Quicken on the web. You can enable this feature by going to the Mobile and Web tab on the Desktop Program's home screen. In the Quicken Mobile and Web page, click Get Started. Select the accounts that you want to sync to Quicken on the web or the companion app and click Done. Once the initial sync is complete, you will see which accounts were enabled for the mobile and web sync on the right-hand side. Going forward, whenever you want to sync your Quicken data to your mobile devices, you will just need to click Sync Now.